hey everyone welcome to the technical voice and this is the last video of this uh, tutorial so in this video we will discuss about a suspend activate and cancel subscription so what's the difference between uh, these terms that suspend activate and cancel so whenever you create a subscription uh, it's uh, its status is that pending and once the user redirect to the PayPal uh, uh, portal and it says that everything is okay and it says agreed and subscribe the subscription status changed to the, to the active okay so now for example there is user want to uh, cancel it and uh, or something has happened and you want to cancel it so you can send the request to cancel subscription okay mm, if you have sent the cancel subscription then you cannot activate it again okay but let's say that for some time period user wants or you have some business logic that for some particular time you want to suspend the subscription and that the recurring payment will not occur then you can send the suspend subscription and then you can activate the subscription okay so can, if you cancel the subscription you cannot activate it but if you suspend the subscription you can activate it so let's see in the action that uh, for example I have a subscription uh, let's get its details uh, so the subscription ID is this one and let me send the request and it say that the status is active okay so let me send first the activate okay well, let's see what happens if I send the activate so it will uh, say that the request action is because the subscription status is invalid invalid subscription status for active action the subscription status should be suspended so if the subscription is already activated then how you can activate it again okay so let me suspend it if I suspend it you can see that it said 204 no content and if I send the request and you can see that its status is suspended now you can activate it let me activate it and it's done and if I go and see the uh, status is active and if I go and cancel it let me cancel it it's just cancelled and if I go and activate it again you can see that it say that it, this is the invalid so once you cancel the subscription you cannot activate it okay so that's oh, that's the difference between activate and uh, suspend and cancel now its status is cancelled so I have added its uh, code into here mm, you can test it at yourself you just need to uh, for example if you want to do something let's say you want to cancel it what you need to do is so why is not running program so how you will send the request so you will send that for example in order to send this cancel 7 and then the URL okay let me send it uh, it will give the error but just to show you that it works okay and then F11 and and what the response is 402 and it will say that because this is the same that if you have the cancel subscription you cannot cancel it again okay 
so that's how you can cancel activate and suspend your subscription so that's it for this video and for this series as well okay so if you like the video and if you have any suggestion if you have any question you can just comment in the uh, comment section thanks for watching the whole series and thanks for your support thanks bye bye